Lech Ski Resort is located in the Arlberg region of the Alps in the northeast of Austria's Vorarlberg province, which is close to the Swiss border. Lech is known as one of the world's prime ski destinations of the Royal British family and the Royal Dutch family and other rich and famous. Lech sits in a valley in the middle of Ski Arlberg, Austria's most extensive and best ski area. In this video, you will learn about the most important things you need to know before booking a vacation in Lech. Watch until the end and discover all the future developments of the ski area and fabulous tips that will allow you to make better decisions and have a more enjoyable ski holiday. Ski Arlberg, which Lech is a part of, made two significant developments in the last decade. The building of Aunfeldjet gondola that connected the Lech Oberlech Zors ski area to Warth Schrocken ski area and the later development, the formation of the Flexenbahn gondola system. The latter connected Lech Sirs to St. Anton St. Christoph Steuben ski area, previously connected only with ski bus. Ski Arlberg has 305 km of ski slopes for every ski level plus another 200 km of ski routes, which are marked off piste areas. With the Arlberg card, you can use all 88 lifts. They never feel too crowded because there is a limit for daily sales. As the top ski area in Austria, you will find the top of the notch of ski lifts here. Some of the chairlifts have under seat heaters that will warm your frozen buttock. Ski Arlberg slopes are divided into 43% of blue runs, 40% of red runs, and 17% of black runs. Add to that the 200 kilometers of ski routes, and we can definitely say that this is a ski area suited for advanced skiers. Lech is more suited for beginners and intermediates in the Arlberg region than other resorts. The Ski Arlberg highest lift is Valiga 2, at the height of 2,810 meters, leading to some crazy off-pistes. Still, for the average Joe, the ski area highest altitude is 2,660 meters on the Schindler Peak, and the lowest slope ends in Schrocken at the height of 1,266 meters above sea level. The ski season in Lech runs from the beginning of December until late April. On the west front of the northern edge of the Alps, the Arlberg Mountains are known for being the most snow-abundant ski area in the Alps. The average annual snowfall in Lech is 8 metres. Zur's average is 10.5 metres. And the Warthschrocken area is the snowiest ski area in Europe, with an average of 10.7 metres. The Tiroler side of the Arlberg is not far behind, with an annual average of 7 metres of snowfall. Snow cannons cover 220 kilometers of pistes, equating to approximately 72% of Ski Arlberg runs. You can find the best snow in the Ski Arlberg area on Rendel and Steuben North Face. The best snow around Lech is in the north facing slopes between the Kriegerhorn and the bottom of the Steinmarder chair. This fast eight seater will take you to the shoulder of Monenflue Mountain. Here you will find many great runs for various levels. Generally, the slopes facing east are the easier, while the runs facing south are the more challenging. The white ring which connects Lech, Zuos, Zug and Oberlech is a half-day challenge. It's a 22km ski run and an altitude of 5,500 meters and is one of the world's famous ski circles.
If this is not enough, Skiarlberg has the most extensive circle in the world, run of fame, with 85 kilometers of runs and stretches from Warth in the north, all the way to Riffelbahn 2 top station, the southern point of the Arlberg ski area. If you are a fan of snow parks, then Lech Snow Park has 20 obstacles accessible using the Schlegelkopf chairlift. In addition, you can find another snow park at the top of Rendelbar in St. Anton. For on mountain restaurants, we recommend Radau, Panchnagare on Schlegelkopf slope, Der Wolf, between Petersboden Express and Weibermard Lift's top stations. Last but not least, Baumalp on the top station of Zugerbergbahn, where the views are breathtaking, the vibe is good, and the food is delicious and served fast. Lech is the only place in Austria that offers heli ski. You can reach an off piste trail via helicopter, with two different fantastic peak locations to choose from, including Melsack Summit and Schneeterli Orgelschatte. Heli ski packages can easily be booked through the ski schools within Lech and can accommodate up to four people in one package. As the Arlberg region has been the pioneer of ski schools, Lech has a variety of courses here. For example, six days by four hours adult group lesson costs 475 euros. Advanced skiers can begin group lessons any day. For beginners and children, there is a designated separate area. Lek accommodation is considered on the high cost side and needs to be reserved in advance. If you want to meet some royals and budget is not an issue, we recommend you stay right in the center of town at the Hotel Arlberg, a five-star hotel that offers ski and ski out. It is the choice of the Swedish royal family for their annual ski holiday and was Princess Diana favorite. Another hotel, just next to the previous one, is Hotel Montsabon. This is a traditional mountain hotel with family-sized apartments. Hotel Haldenhof is a luxury hotel just a few minutes walk from the lifts with excellent facilities. The traditional family-run hotel, Sandhof, with an excellent restaurant, is recommended for families and mixed-level groups. Just behind Sandhof is Garni Lavendel, which has various apartments and, like Sandhof, is well located recommended ski and ski out hotel with a reasonable price is Hotel Angela on the lower part of the Schlegelkopf slope. Another excellent hotel, yet far from the lifts, is Hotel Schmelzhof. Lech has a busy main road running through it, but Oberlech is car free. Oberlech can be reached only by cable car. The cable car operates from 7 a.m. to 11 p.m. daily. There is a direct underground passage to the hotels on the top station. Oberlek is recommended especially for families with children and has its own ski kindergarten in the middle of the village. It is the village with the highest number of real ski and ski-out accommodations in Austria. The Goldener Berg Hotel is a great four-star hotel to stay in Oberlek. It's well known for its acclaimed Johannes Dubli restaurant and it's a great dining place for a break during your ski day. In addition, it has 360 degrees mountain views and plenty of activities for kids. Another great four stars hotel is Bergkristall. This family run hotel suits families with small children as it sits just above the ski kindergarten. Two luxurious hotels we recommend in Oberlech is Berg Hotel and Sonnenberg Hotel. If your company become a unicorn or you are just rich and famous and you want to rent a fantastic catered chalet, Try Chalet N. Lek has much to offer other than great skiing. It offers ubiquitous sleigh rides, ice skating, curling, more than 40 kilometers of marked and cleared trails for winter hiking. In addition, Lek has 27 kilometers of cross-country ski trails, most of which stretch out from Lek towards Zug and beyond the village of Zug. Lech has some beautiful sites of cultural interest that are well worth visiting. Such is the Gothic Church of St. Nicholas with its 33 meter high bell tower. The Apres ski scene here is nothing like the lively neighbor St. Anton. 
After you ski to the main street from the Schladelkopf slope, you won't miss the bar at Hotel Tannenbergerhof where you can find one of the best glue wines in the Alps and the lovely terrace bar at Hotel Krone. Both are the most popular places in town. If you are riding down the Rufikofbahn back to town, check out the bar at Hotel Fekirkorn, which will be to your left on the main street. In Oberleck, you can enjoy yourself at the ice bar of the Berg Hotel, which is a popular après spot, as is the champagne bar at the Hotel Montana. For a ski lunch or dinner, we recommend the restaurant at Berg Hotel. Try the Salzburg and Ockerl there. In Leck, we recommend good Austrian food at Hus No. 8 restaurant for dinner. Another good one for dinner is Fux restaurant. Before we give you our conclusions and insider tips, let's see how to get to Leck. The closest airport to Leck is St. Gallen in Switzerland. It takes an hour and 14 minutes drive. The other close airports are Innsbruck, Austria and Friedrichshafen, Germany, with a driving time of about an hour and a half. The closest major airport is Zurich, with a driving time of around 2 hours and 15 minutes. Pay note that the road between Wath and Lech is close during ski season, and you have to drive through Zurs in high altitude in the snowiest area in the Alps, so come with snow chains just in case. Don't forget to buy the highway toll sticker before entering Austria. Suppose you come with public transportation, Take a train to St. Anton and take a bus to Lech. If you plan a vacation on Ski Arlberg and beginners and intermediates are the majority in your group, Lech is probably the best option. It has a big designated beginners area and many long blue runs and easy gentle red runs. On the other hand, if you are looking for good apres ski parties and nightlife scenes, St. Anton is your place. In Lech, you can have apres ski with your friend and find fantastic wines, champagnes and other high society indulgences. Lech has shorter lift lines than St. Anton, but yours has even smaller queues. If you love ski and ski out, Oberlech is your place. Some hotels here are the most expensive in Austrian ski resorts, but you get what you pay for if you have the dime. So, before we reveal the insider tips, here are scores for Lech. Beginners, 8.5. Intermediates, 9.5. Advanced skiers, 9. Snowboarders, 9. Freestylers, 7. Freeriders, 10. Apres ski, 6.5. Nightlife, 6. Resort Charm 8.5. Our total score for Lech is 8.6. Before we will give you our excellent tips, if you want to compare Lech to other ski resorts, please visit our website skiresortsvideo.com, linked in the description. Use our comparison engine for an overview side-by-side -side, of 15 essential criteria of up to six ski resorts simultaneously and learn more about the best ski resorts. Here are our insider tips. First tip, the best slope to warm up in the morning is Schladelkopf. It faces southeast, long, wide and not steep. Great for carving when it is not busy. Our second tip, if you are a challenge lover, you will find here a ski route which is steeper than the steepest run in Austria, the famous Harakiri. The name of this ski route is Langer Zug, and it has an 80% gradient in the upper third of this groomed ski route. So, if you love the Alberg region but Lech or Zors are too relaxed for you, we highly recommend you to watch our review on St. Anton here. If you search for a ski resort with fast and comfy ski lifts, very large ski area and astounding view, you must watch our excellent review about Zermatt, Switzerland, 